this is video number five of Tableau do it yourself tutorial using dynamic calculation by Bharti W consultancy in this video we are going to talk about how to create a dynamic calculation and then how to use it for now please use the data connection from the video number one of this Tableau do it yourself series so open the pwb file which is tableau workbook file which you used in the previous exercises and also as mentioned before you can use the data connection from video number one of this series and then go to a new sheet and rename that sheet to vid5 so this is my tableau file from one and then I'm going to click on this new worksheet and I'm going to rename this to DIY vid5. Now right click the employee name from the left side and create set for employees having sales amount less than $2,000. Please use the condition tab to calculate the range for sales amount so let's do it so I'm gonna go to this employee name and then I'm gonna create set for employees so this is employee name right click create set and then I'm going to use the condition tab select by field and I'm gonna say that sum of sales amount is less than 2000 so sum of sales amount is less than 2000 I'm going to create a set and I'm going to name it as sales amount or less than 2k so I'm going to create a name I'm going to say less than 2k sales amount less than 2k and I'm going to click OK next I'm going to create another set for employee having sales amount greater than 4k so I'm gonna go to conditions again by field sales amount greater than 4k and you can see I have put some here sum of sales amount greater than 4k I'm gonna rename it as SA greater than 4k you can see the sets here on this area which we just created similarly create another set for employees having greater than sales amount greater than 4000 which we have already done next is now go to the analysis menu and then create a calculated field with name employee sales band so we are going to create a calculation calculated field with name as employee sales band and we are going to use this formula if sales amount less than 2k set this is the set remember we created set here in step number four if sales amount is less than 2k then band is less than 2k this is the text you can see it's in the text else if the sales amount is greater than 4k then band greater than 4k if none of these conditions are satisfied then band is between 2k 2 to 4k let me put 2k here 2 2k to 4k 
let's do that so go to analysis create calculated field Time, type the calculation employee sales band and then I'm going to write the same calculation which I just showed you so the same calculation I just showed you here make sure the calculation is valid once you are done click on OK and you would see the employee sales band here next add the employee location from the dimensions to the rows shelf and add sales amount in the column shelf let's do that employee location in the rows shelf and sales amount in the column shelf so employee locations in the row shelf and sales amount from the measures drag and drop in the column shelf. Next drag the newly created calculated field employee sales band to the color area. So I created this employee sales band I'm going to drag and drop to the color area and there you go you can see that the band of employees are available here so AP HR and IL it's all one or two brands but MD is this is the lower brand this is the lower of uh, the mid band and it is the upper band I can change the layout here and there you go I can change the layout to form a different thing look at that so this is how you can do your dynamic calculations and see how it looks like I can also add employee sales in the filters and I'm gonna select use all once in the filter area in order to change the filter I'm gonna say right click show filter I repeat once in the filter area right click say show filter and you will see the filter on the right so if I want to focus on the top bands that means greater than 4k sorry greater than 4k and the 2k to 4k I'm gonna disable less than 2k there you go I want to disable this and these this is only band 4k so you can see how you can create dynamic sets and then use it in order to understand how the data is working all right so time for pausing the video here and be prepared on your tableau desktop and we are going to do this hands-on exercise which is coming up so pause the video here and then get ready this is your do-it-yourself exercise number 10 add a new sheet create a set for pay type now you can use the sales amount ranges for from 0 to 10k 10k to 20k and over 20k and create a calculated field for pay type sales band next add sales amount in the columns shelf add channel type in the row shelf marks and add the newly created pay type sales band in the color section so um, so make sure that you are able to do it in order to proceed further also the text which is sh right now shown on the video is available in, in the comment section of this YouTube video
keep practicing tableau do it yourself exercises thank you